Hello, hello, hello. Hello, everybody. You call me in the middle of still getting ready. I have to set up the the Instagrams. There we are. <coughs> Hello, everybody. Good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Happy 2023. 2023, yeah. I'm like, am I putting too many T's over there? But no, they're just the right amount of T's. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome to Coffee Break with Tara by Laura. Laundry Arcade and Devadas. <laughs> Hi, my Blair, my Blair. Welcome to Coffee Break with Tarot by Laura Gonzalez. On this January 2nd of 2023, we have um, Tarot for the Week. Tarot for the Week. And... Um, Okay, let me, um, I have to boot somebody of my life here. How do you boot people? Okay, report comment. And then harassment. And then me. And band. Thank you. I don't need, this is not a dating site. <laughs> People on, on Instagram trying to go on my live and talking all kinds of nonsense. That's what happens when you have... My platform is so tiny, though. I don't know what the heck. By the way, by the way, now that I remember, please, 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 please never, ever, ever, ever give out your personal information we had um, a clone account on Facebook. Somebody decided that it was a good idea to clone my account. And then they were harassing my friends for supposedly a tour reading for $30. I don't even charge $30 for a private session, so it's not me. <laughs> but most importantly... Don't ever give your personal information. Don't ever give money to someone that you don't know. And if you ever think it's me, for whatever reason, they clone the account so well that you think it's me, um, ask me immediately for a video chat. And I promise you, I will video chat you right away because I love video chatting. Uh, this is not an invitation to video chat. No, it is kind of. But anyway, um, we have Tarot for the Week. And Caro Gonville says that she don't understand. But, oh, Carolina Gonzalez, prima! <laughs> My cousin from Chile. We say we're cousins because we have the same last name. Last name. Anyway, we're going to do Tarot for the Week. Um... I, if you watch the card of the year for 2023, you know there's going to be a lot of um, events happening on 2023. Some spell classes, spell classes that will happen uh, once a month. And the new moon on Mondays, the new moon on Mondays that will happen once a month on a Monday night at Maliway Brothers at 7.30 p.m. Stay tuned for that because uh, we have confirmation. We have confirmation and it will be announced soon. And it will be part class, part ritual. Or kind of like a discussion and a ritual rather than class. Speaking of class, we have the Page of Swords reverse as a reading for today. And it fits perfectly with the energy for today. 
we're still in the middle of uh, Mercury retrograde, either the last one of 2022 or the first one of 2023, whichever way you want to count it. Uh, so Mercury is on Gatorade. Mercury is on retrograde and communications could be a little bit haywire. And this card could be very well representing that in which communications are not be, being ideal. Um, when she comes right side up, she's talking about being, being curious and asking questions and trying to learn new things. When she's upside down, it's like, what? Like, I'm not understanding anything. In this case, um, it could also very well represent that, hey, you don't need to ask questions. Just go do the thing. However, comma, the message being by herself, I don't have any other cards to um, give you more context. So I will take it as, what? I don't understand what's going on. And... Uh, you know, that's that's exactly what could be happening here. So my advice for all of us is that this week we dot our I's, cross our T's, and be very, very mindful of our communications, how we are communicating with other people. And it's also very important, what are we receiving? How are we listening to others? Are we actually paying attention to what other people are saying? And are we actively listening or are we just trying to get a response right away? So thank you everybody for being here. I'm trying to read uh, Insta, but it's so tiny. So thank you to Patska and Caro Gonzalez, my prima. Laundry Arcade, Govinda Sai, Eva G. Rodriguez, and to Leilani and to Blair. Thank you for watching. Uh, it says I have four people watching, but only two have come in. If you don't come in, I don't know who you are. So anyway, so fitting with the card for today. Um, be very mindful of what you say, how you say it, how you listen listen and be mindful of all of your communications and if you don't understand something ask i rather ask a million times than agree to something where i don't understand fully and in my opinion it shows more strength and wisdom to ask questions than to assume anything because how the say goes when you assume you make an ass of you and me I think it's like that so anyway we have a second card for today we're gonna pull an oracle card for the week and this is an oracle from the divine animals oracle by Stacy DeMarco and we have the tiger we have the tiger. <laughs> oh my God, Leilani. Leilani says, I need that toy for my mouth today. Yes, ask questions. It, you know, I it happens. It happens that sometimes we need that duct tape. Uh, be gentle with yourselves, though. I mean, I'm not sure if duct tape is ideal. It will hurt. But, you know being mindful seems to be the theme uh, also when you are not listened to try as you may not to take it personal and repeat yourself and repeat yourself with clarity until the person who's listening understand what you're saying because if they don't understand what you're saying then they're going to have expectations that you are not going to fulfill. So it's, it's also part of having healthy, clear boundaries, you know, so don't despair and just repeat yourself, you know, if needed, uh, let's repeat ourselves. Hi, Charlie Navarro. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So, uh, the tiger Panthera Tigris says, 
Uh, exercise your will and determination in ethical ways. Do not place your will over another's. You do not have control over anyone but yourself. Do not be afraid to be fierce, especially as a woman. We can ride our healthy anger, but we must eventually transform it into something more useful. Uh, again, you know, if you're not understood, if, if communication ain't clear, repeat, ask, set a boundary, repeat again, rinse and repeat. So uh, the card of the tiger talks about will. Exercise your will and determination in ethical ways. Do not place your will over another's. You do not have control over anyone but yourself. Do not be afraid to be fierce, especially as a woman. We can ride our healthy anger, but we must eventually transform it into something more useful. So there you have it, folks. Um, let me reiterate. <coughs> Excuse me. Yours truly will be offering services on the new moon at Maliway Brothers once a month on the Monday closest to the new moon. There's going to be a shared discussion and meditation and then a ritual. Those are going to be ticketed events. Uh, it's only a $25 ticket and it's going to be fun because it's going to be at Malaway and you can come and shop for your witchy needs and all the information is going to be shared on all my social media. I'm also going to be teaching uh, spells for the month class the whole year. Those are going to be by Zoom and same thing, be um, follow my socials. Actually, if you can go to my link tree and follow my link tree so you can uh, check all the classes and events and send your good energy, please. I'm currently speaking with a space in Pilsen to host full moon celebrations. I cannot tell you anything more about that Pilsen because I don't know anything yet, but send your good vibes so that we can rent that space and or have access to the space so that we can offer full moon celebrations uh, this Sunday closest to the full moon. I will keep you posted. I am really hopeful. So I will be doing if everything goes according to plan. Thank you, goddess. Full moon celebrations will happen on the Sunday closest to the full moon. New moon celebrations will happen on the Monday closer to the full moon. And the Zoom online uh, spell classes will happen on a Sunday evening uh, once a month. Follow my socials so you can be informed. Thank you, Leilani. I really, really am hoping that I get this space have access to it and continue. We haven't had a service publicly <clears throat> since February of 2020. It's far too long. Um, we need to offer the services again. So I'm very glad that um, Maliway opened their doors for us. Uh, that's going to be like a, a little bit more of a class format, class discussion and then ritual. And the Pilsen thing, I hope, is most like uh, a full moon celebration that we can offer to the to the public. So keep your fingers crossed. And then, of course, you know, Lunatic Mondays and then the coffee break and everything, you know, continues. Uh, the most auspicious, happy new year to every single one of y'all. And until we meet again, you are loved. Bye-bye.